All right, guys, it is that time of year. It is time for a free mini scheme. So this full scheme is going to be on winmadden.com. You can get a good chunk of it for free, but this is part of our brand new Los Angeles Rams offensive ebook, and this is for current gen and next gen. Again, I've heard you current gen users. You want some offense. You want some attention and love. I'm going to give it to you. But on top of that, all of this does work on next gen as well. And I will show that in this video. So we're going to cover part one. If you want the full scheme, head over to winmadden.com, become a free member. You can get access to the full mini scheme of Deuce Close here. And if you want access to the full ebook, you can become a premium member and get access to not only this ebook, but all of our ebooks on winmadden.com. So with that said, let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, like, comment, subscribe. Here we go. All right, guys, now here we are. Now, this is play number one, again, of the mini scheme. If you want the full mini scheme, head over to winmadden.com. It's 100% free for the full deuce close mini scheme. Now, if you want the full ebook, again, go to winmadden.com, the full ebook, become a premium member. You get access to everything in the Los Angeles Rams offensive ebook. And if you want access to everything on the website, it actually comes with a premium membership. We actually have seven different ebooks on there right now. Go check it out. But with that said, we're going to talk about play number one. And play number one is going to be PA X post cross. Now, I will say for this play in particular, you either need Hot Route Master or you need to have Tight End Apprentice. So I will say that for this play, not every play in the mini scheme requires that, but this one does. So we're going to go to PA X post cross. And what we are going to try to do in this is we're going to try to bomb cover two, cover three, and cover four. We will be able to accomplish that in next gen. In current gen, we will be able to bomb cover two and cover three, but cover four just doesn't quite work in current gen, and I will show you that as well on current gen. So again, PA X post cross on offense, on defense, we're gonna come out in uh, three, four odd. Again, I'm only choosing three, four odd because it's got a cover four in it that doesn't match. Uh, if you know what I mean, if you know what I mean, that's great. Uh, now you're gonna notice here, we are on the left hash mark. Now that is very important. We need to be on a hash mark and we are currently on the left one. Now what's important about that is the deep post by Robert Woods is starting on the short side of the field and running towards the wide side of the field. That is how this bomb is going to work. So you need to make sure that your setup looks like this. Your deep post route needs to be starting on the short side, running towards the wide side. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to talk the setup. The setup is very, very simple, very, very easy. What we're going to do is we're going to streak Hopkins, our tight end. So in order to do a hot route, again, some of you are very familiar with this. Some of you aren't, which is fair. We're going to hit Y on Xbox, Triangle, and PlayStation. We're going to hit Y again for the receiver that we want a hot route, and then we're going to hit up on the left stick. That is going to put him on a streak, right? So the next one we're going to make, this is the one that is going to require either Hot Route Master or Tight End Apprentice, is we're going to put our A receiver, which is our tight end on the right side, onto a corner route. So again, we're going to hit Y on Xbox, Triangle, and PlayStation, A, and then we're going to hit right on the D-pad to put him on a corner route. Now, the play is set up. We've got a one-play touchdown here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cheat on the first play. So sorry, everybody. But I'm going to QB spy out everybody who's rushing just to make sure we have time so I can show you the play. Practice mode is absolutely insane with his block sheds. Just doesn't shed nearly the same as it does in game. Uh, but anyway, you can do whatever you want with the running back. You can keep him on his play action. You can cancel the play action. You can block him. You can put him on a route. I don't care. It uh, doesn't matter. You can do whatever you want with him. So again, we're going to snap the ball here. And Robert Woods kind of gets a little bit bumped there, but you're going to see we're going to be able to pass lead this straight to the right. Robert Woods, huge play. Should have been a one-play score. Tom Brady just kind of has a noodle arm. But again, you get it. Easy, easy, huge gain against cover three. I'll show you exactly what's happening here in instant replay. And again, Here's what is important. This streak route, again, we hot routed this streak route. That's why it's important to make this hot route, is going to hold this deep third in the middle of the field. That deep third will not come and play Robert Woods because he has to pay attention to this streak route. That is going to give us a huge leverage advantage there. But where is the deep third over here, you might ask, right? There's supposed to be somebody in a cover three playing him. Well, this deep third gets pulled down by the corner route. There's no reason a corner route should pull down this deep third, just by the way, but you can see this corner route, we put this hot route on, he comes all the way down to try to play that corner route, leaving all of this green area for us to throw this one play touchdown to Robert Woods. Again, noodle arm by Tom Brady, should have been a one play touchdown, but you get it. 
All right, so you're probably wondering, does this work in current gen though, right? So here we are in current gen, it's the exact same setup. We're gonna streak Y, we're gonna put A on a corner out. We're gonna block our running back this time, but again, you can see the setup is exactly the same, and maybe we wanna double team so we can roll out to the right a little bit. Let's snap the ball. So here we go, we've got the double team, it's gonna allow us to roll out. We've got time, and we're able to bomb again cover three I needed to pass with that up a little bit more I plan to it straight to the right but you get the idea we were still able to bomb it for a one play score against cover three now, now that's cover three what about in cover two right so let's try this in cover two uh, we'll make the audible real quickly we're gonna go to a Tampa two here's what it looks like doesn't really matter if it's a Tampa two uh, um, you know, I'll cover two with soft squats, hard flats, doesn't matter. It's not going to make any difference here. So again, same setup. We're going to streak Y. We're going to put A in a corner out. Again, I don't care what you do with your running back. Do whatever you want with them. Uh, we're going to snap the ball. And we're going to hope that the pass rush doesn't scream at us. And you can see easy one play score against cover two as well. So we'll show you again one more time in instant replay what is happening here and why this is working so well. So again, as we go into instant replay here and we take a look, the same things are happening. So we've got the streak route. Remember that streak route? Well, he takes this deep half out of the play. If we don't have this streak route, this deep half will actually slide over and start to play this deep post. Now the other deep half, where the heck is he? Well, again, he is being occupied by this corner route. There's no reason a deep half should play this corner route, but he is. And that allows us to throw this right over to the top, straight up pass lead, easy one play score against the cover two. All right, now I want to show you cover two. Does it work against cover two? Same exact setup, right? So we streak Y, we put A on a corner out. Again, you can do whatever you want with a running back. This time, we're just going to let him go through the play action. So we snap the ball. And again, you can see we get through the play action. X wide open, easy one play score against cover two. And it also works in current gen. All right, well, that's cover three and that's cover two. What about cover four? Let's try cover four here real quickly. So again, we're gonna audible into a cover four. Again, just wanna show you, it actually is a cover four. And you're gonna see if we do the exact same setup, so nothing changes, right? A on a corner out, Y on a streak. And again, do whatever you want with your running back. I don't care. And maybe we want to double team here and slide the line that way just to see if we can try to roll out. I don't know if it'll work. But again, we got the double team. We're gonna roll out. And if you wait long enough, once he clears that guy, you're gonna be able to get him for a one play score against cover four. Now, All right, finally, we're gonna show against cover four in current gen. Now I will say, I would love to say this works in cover four in current gen, it just doesn't. So I'm gonna streak and I'm gonna put the corner out on there and you're just gonna see the same setup, same exact things happen, but we're not able to bomb in cover four. Let's just show you exactly kind of what happens here. So he just gets too deep. Um, it just doesn't work. Again, you can maybe get lucky and come down with that, but that is oftentimes what does happen in cover four in current gen. So in current gen, this is a cover three and a cover two bomb. In uh, next gen, it's a cover two, cover three, and cover four bomb. So hopefully you're enjoying it though. Let's get back to the video. Four. Now we did bomb cover two, cover three, cover four. This play is absolutely something that is incredibly dangerous. You need to have it in your arsenal. You need a little bit of time for it, but it is deadly can bomb every different coverage in the game in next gen. So again, current gen doesn't quite bomb cover four, but does bomb cover two and cover three very, very well. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Again, if you want access to the full scheme, head over to winmadden.com. It's absolutely free on the website. Become a free, me free member. You get access to the full Deuce Close mini scheme on the website. And if you want access to the full ebook, head over to Win Madden, become a premium member. It gets access not only to the Rams ebook, but all the other ebooks as well on our website. So with that said, if you're new to the channel here, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell for when we drop new videos. Like always, till next time, win Madden.